Good day everyone! Welcome back to Ram's tutorial, especially to our viewers. If you are new here in my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you are updated on my latest videos. Today we are going to discuss about how to find the circumferences of these two circles. In finding the circumference of the two circles, we have first here, we are going to use the formula which is c is equal to pi d c is equal to 2 pi r d means is what we call stands for diameter and r stands for radius in solving this class don't forget to memorize or to know the value of pi which is 3.14 this will be the value of pi 3.14 so now we are going to solve in letter a we have first here first circle okay so we have first six linear units all we have to do here because our drawing it shows about the diameter so that's why c is equal to pi d c class is what we called the circumference we're going to write Sir, come, fi, rinse. Like that. <clears throat> Circumference. D is for the diameter. R is for radius. Okay, let's go back to letter A. So we're going to write now C is equal to, sorry for my pi design, pi D, like that. Next, equal should be organized guys Kunin natin dito ang what to call this uh the value of pi which is 3.14 we're going to write it here 3.14 next times six where did i get six for the given six linear units now we are going to multiply 3.14 times six i'll show you how to multiply we have first here please follow me so that we can get the what you call answer 3.14 times 6 4 times 6 is 24 we're bring down 4 here we group 2 1 times 6 the answer is 6 plus the regroup 2 the answer is 8 bring down 8 next is 3 times 6 okay we're going to write 8 10 Okay, let's count first here, putting the decimals, 1, 2, 1, 2, here. So the answer is 18.84. So remember, class or student, when you write 18.84, you write it here, you're going to transfer 18.84. Don't forget to write the word linear units to make your answer complete. Okay? I'm going to write 18.84 linear units. Is it done, teacher Ram? Yes. This will be our answer. ENS. Simple, right? So we need to know our what you call symbol or the value of pi, which is 3.14. Next. For number 2 or letter B, we have 4 linear units. But actually, class, our drawing shows about the half of this circle. So, talking about half of these circles, this is what we call radius. R stands for radius. So, we're going to rewrite C is equal to 2 pi R is equal to we are going to write guys two here two then times the value of pi remember which is 3.14 3.14 times linear units which is four okay we are going to multiply first here 3.14 times two 2 times 4, we have 8, 
1 times 2, we have 2. 3 times 2, we have 6. Okay, let's continue. Times 4. We have 8 times 4, 32. Right, guys? We, we are going to regroup 3 here. So we don't forget to count regroup 3. Next is we're going to multiply 2 times 4. The answer is 8. Next, 8, eight rather, yeah. So don't forget 3, 8, 19, 11. So this is 11. So regroup 1, sorry. Next is 6 times 4 is 24 plus 1 is 25. Let's just count first. 1, 2. We have here. 1, 2. So our answer is, I'm going to write 25.5. 12. This will be our final answer 25.12. Don't forget to write the word linear units. Why I discuss each guys on how to multiply so that you will know how to find the answer. Again, to find the circumferences of these two circles, so you need to uh, think or put in your mind, just keep in your mind that. The value of phi is 3.14. Okay? So we're going to proceed to number 3. I have here a drawing for number 3, guys. Okay. Okay, we have first 9 units. So we're going to get the diameter, the radius, and the circumference. Obviously, for letter E, the diameter is 9. Next, for radius, we're going to find it out. The radius of this so next we're going to find the radius half of this is what we call remember this is nine units half of this circle like this it's one okay i'm going to show you so we're going to divide here nine divide two because half of the radius half kalahati po so we'd have divide nine divide two we have four times 2 we have 8 9 minus 8 we have 1 so so 1 cannot be to 2 so we're going to add 0 so we put point here or decimal point we we'll bring down 0 to make it whole number so 10 divide to 2 the answer is 5 5 times 2 the answer is 10 continue lang guys so this will be our answer 4.5 our radius Next, circumference. Okay, we're going to define for circumference. Circumference is equal to 3.14 times 9. We're going to solve 3.14 times 9. 9 times 4, 36. We have 3. 1 times 9, 9 plus 3, 12. Group 1. 9 times 3, 27 plus 1, 28, it is count 1, 2, 1, 2, we have the decimal point. So our answer now is 28.26, guys. So remember, the value of pi is 3.14. Did you understand? Hope this video will help, especially in graders, mathematics topic about finding the circumference of these circles by what we call multiplying it properly okay following the rules okay so that your answer is correct once again guys good day and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel thanks for watching bye bye